For USCFSales.com, I'm Steve Lopez with another Fritz 13 tip for you. We've been looking at online features, the big new stuff that's in Fritz 13, and we have another thing to look at this week that we've not considered before. One of the things that Fritz will allow you to do is submit a position to the worldwide community of users for their analysis. In fact, there's a button for it right up here, Submit Position. However, in order to be able to submit a position, you have to earn credits to be able to do it. Every position that you submit costs you a credit. Now, credits are like money, but you don't buy them with money. You buy them with time. They don't cost you any cash at all. There's no money involved, but you do have to use some time to do it. What I mean by that is this. We're going to look at, at the first feature that you need to use before you start submitting your own positions. It's called Contribute Engine. If you notice at the top of the screen here, in the Engine menu in Fritz, you've got a Contribute Engine button, which is grayed out, by the way. Can't use it till you log in, and we'll show you that in a moment. But what you're doing, by contributing an engine, what you're actually doing is you are taking your computer and letting the worldwide community of users kind of use it. They're not hacking into your machine or anything, but what's going to happen is the server is going to submit a series of chess positions to your computer for your chess engine to analyze. And we're going to show you how it works. It's actually very benign, but it, it's something you can do, for example, while you sleep. Set your computer up, set Fritz up, click Contribute Engine, go to bed, and in the morning you're going to have a whole pile of credits. For every position you analyze, you get a credit that you can use then to submit your own positions for analysis. I'm going to show you how this works. First thing you have to do, and by the way, you can start this from any position. What you have on your chessboard and your Fritz doesn't factor into this at all. So I just clicked on New Game. So we're starting from a, a brand new fresh board. You can start from any place, any board position. It doesn't matter because it doesn't factor into it. What you do first is you click on Let's Check. We'll go down here and zoom in on it and show you. Click on Let's Check. That logs you in, and then once you're logged in, once you're connected to the server, the Contribute Engine becomes available to you. And then we're going to show you what happens after you click on Contribute Engine. The first step, though, before you do anything, make sure you have the engine that you want to use selected. Uh, you can use Fritz 13. You can use any engine that runs in the Fritz interface. It doesn't matter. Pick whatever engine you want to use, whatever engine you want to have analyzed positions that other people have submitted for analysis. But first you must click Let's Check. Then the Contribute Engine button becomes available to you. You can click on that, and that will connect you to the server. I will show you a little brief sample of what happens after you contribute your engine. Now, as I said, you can start this from any board position. I, right now, I have this on the board position from our last video from last week. First, you have to get online by clicking Let's Check. Then you click the Submit Engine button. There's a slight pause while the server goes out and fetches a position for you. There we go. It just found position number one. And what you're going to see, if you look down in the lower right-hand side of the screen, is you see Fritz 13, the engine I've selected, analyzing the position. Immediately to the right of that, we've got the Let's Check updated information. This is what I'm sending to the server, and it's constantly updated as Fritz 13 looks deeper and deeper and deeper into the position. Also notice we have a message screen right above that, that black little pane there, a message pane. It gives us updated information, in fact it's just updated, telling us what's going on with the server, who's winning variations, who's discovering positions, all that information. Now what's going to happen here is Fritz, I've, I've already looked at this uh, earlier, Fritz is going to analyze this position for just over two minutes and when it's done or actually when the server decides, it will then feed another position. So right now we're looking at our first position. That's what that message display says in the middle of the screen. And after a couple of minutes, it will feed us another position to analyze, and this will run for as long as we let it. For every position that our engine analyzes, we get a credit towards submitting our own positions at a later time if we want to. And you'll see that happen when we get to the end of the road here. Well, I'm going to let this run. We're going to have a look at uh, 
at, at what this does. I said it takes a little over two minutes. It'll feed another position. And then we're going to fade out and go to the end of the line here. We'll show you how to disconnect. Basically, you just go up and reverse the process. You click the Contribute Engine button a second time to stop this process. And then you can click Let's Check a second time to actually disconnect from the server. As we've seen, to get out of this process, once you're done contributing your engine, once you've finished analyzing positions that other people have submitted, just click the Contribute Engine button again to stop that process. That just gets you back to where your engine is just on the uh, Let's Check server analyzing the current board position. Then you click Let's Check again to disconnect from the server. But before you do that, have a look at this display. I've, I've cut and pasted it here to zoom in on it to show you that at this point, by the time I, now I had done a bunch of these before, by the way, I didn't earn 112 credits just in those five positions. I've done a bunch of this. But in, I've analyzed five more positions, I've earned five more credits. My current total credits are shown in this display when I disconnect, when I stop the contribute engine process, not disconnect, but when I stop the process, I get a thank you and a value for my total credits. That's what I've earned so far, 112 credits thus far. So that will be shown here in blue in the scrolling message window that's part of the uh, Let's Check display. Something else that may happen while you're analyzing positions for other people is you may win that position. If your analysis goes much deeper than anyone else's has, you'll win a position. Here we see my username's Armistead. Armistead won a variation. So I won a variation as part of this process of contributing my engine. So not only did I get credits toward contributing my own positions that I'd like to have analyzed, I also got some points that goes toward my ranking on the top user list, which is pretty cool as well. You can't discover a position. Well, I won't say you can't, but it's highly unlikely you will discover a position through contributing your engine because most likely the contributor has already discovered that position. It's possible, but not likely. But you can win a position, win a variation by analyzing it to a much greater depth than someone has done before. Now you have no control over this by the way. Uh, the server will, as we've seen, will feed you positions at regular intervals. But if you run, for example, if you run a multi-processor engine on a machine that has, let's say, eight cores, you're probably going to win a lot of variations by contributing your engine. Another cool feature of this, by the way, is that every position that you have analyze through this process as well as attempting to discover positions and other things you've done are saved in a let's check database when you go to the database window by hitting F12 or clicking on the uh, the button in the ribbon that kicks you into the game list you'll notice over here in your database view you should see a icon that looks like a check mark and it says let's check and when you click on it you get a scrolling list of all the positions that your engines have been involved in on the server you notice at this point I've actually been involved in trying to analyze over a thousand positions at this juncture so you will see all of the uh, analysis 
that you were involved in, my last five positions should be that, that I just analyzed, as uh, you just saw in the video, should be the final five positions right here on this list, and I can go back and look at those positions if I want to. So you do get to uh, see what positions you've helped analyze. They are fed into a database and saved on your hard drive as part of a Let's Check database. So now that we know how to earn credits by analyzing positions that other people have submitted, how do we submit positions? Well, we're going to look at that the next time around. For USCFSales.com, I'm Steve Lopez. Thanks for watching.